of rapture heresy is spiritual theft. I'm going to show that to you in this video. So, how is the post trip rapture heresy spiritual theft? Well, first of all, the post trip rapture heresy steals the peace you have with God. Every single Pauline epistle opens up with peace from God. Romans chapter 1, verse 7. To all that be in Rome, beloved of God, called to be saints, grace to you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 3. Grace be unto you and peace from God our Father and from the Lord Jesus Christ. 2 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 2. Grace be to you and peace from God our Father and from the Lord Jesus Christ, etc., etc., etc. Every Pauline epistle begins with peace from God. However, in the time of Jacob's trouble, it's God who takes peace from the earth. Re Revelation chapter 6, verse 4. And there went out another horse that was red, and power was given to him that sat thereon to take peace from the earth, and that they should kill one another. And there was given unto him a great sword. So wait a second, God grants you peace, but if you go in the time of Jacob's trouble, God takes your peace. So is God a liar? You know, it steals your peace. Also, the post-tribulational rapture, uh, this heresy, takes away, it gives you a spirit of fear. It takes away your joy and gives you a spirit of fear. Second Timothy chapter 1, verse 7 says, For God hath not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. But the uh, tribulational, if you go into the time of Jacob's trouble, if you're going to have this mentality of, I'm going into the time of Jacob's trouble, and I'm going to face God's wrath for seven years, uh, you're going to have a spirit of fear, especially after reading the horrific things that go on in Revelation, described in the book of Revelation. Don't tell me you can read that and think you're going to go experience that and not have a spirit of fear. But Second Timothy chapter 1, verse 7 says, God hath not given us a spirit of fear. So, which is it? You see what I mean? The post-tribulational heresy is its spiritual theft. It gives you a spirit of fear, takes away your peace, and gives you a spirit of fear. So don't be deceived by the satanic post-trib rapture Catholic heresy that it is. God bless you. Goodbye. Thank you.